Hello, everybody. This is the Roll Bitchy. I'm back. Um, before we get to the 2010 First Annual Greek of the Year Awards, I actually wanted to address a couple things. And you know when I say that I have to address something, it pretty much means I'm about to go in on somebody. Um, I had to talk about two little instances, and then I'm going to go ahead and get to the fun part, the Greek Awards. Um, so, you know... I'm a journalism major, broadcasting minor. Um, you know, I'm more leaning towards doing advertising and journalism, that field of work, when I graduate. And, you know, I'm not really caring about... I am care about the broadcasting part, but, you know, I'm not really trying to do anything with broadcasting. I could if I wanted to. I like to do stuff on film and all that, but, yeah. So, you know, I'm sitting up here in a new class, you know, it's a new semester. You know, where you have to do a radio show. You have to do a radio show, three of them, an hour, each day. And yeah, that's what, how you get your grade. So, you know, I've done the show maybe once or twice. You know, I'm just still freshly learning everything, you know, trying to get, you know, everything wrapped around my head so I can, you know, have a good little radio show like my show now. So, you know, this week I'm sitting in there, you know, doing my little radio show. It's Monday morning. I'm tired. Already a little frustrated. So, you know, somebody comes in. And I'm going to do exactly what they did and give you. Somebody will be texting me right now. Never mind, it's a re reply on Twitter. Um, put that on silent. Anyway, I'm about to do exactly what he did to me, and I'm going to let you guys see. Hold on a second. What is with y'all leaving this door open? Oh, um, I didn't leave it open. Ooh, I dropped my phone, y'all. Troy, you okay? Um, I, didn't leave my, I didn't leave the door open. Um, I wasn't the last person in here last night. Oh, I'm not talking about last night. I'm talking about right now. Why is this door open? When you at home, do you leave the door open? I'm gonna start writing y'all up. This is a um, this is a verbal warning. Okay. See, when I tell you that I've never been more pissed off in my life at somebody, when I tell you that I've never wanted to, I'm not gonna say it, but you know, more than I ever wanted to somebody that day. It was hard for me to bite my bottom lip <laughs> and not curse that man out. I respect my elders, but being a grown man, I expect you to talk to me the same way you wanted to be talking to. And I'm talking directly to you. If you ever come at me like that again, or ever talk to me that way again, I'm going to be fired from WIU radio. Probably banned from Silly. Because... I'm a 21-year-old man, not an 8-year-old child in the playground, spitting on his little sister, getting yelled at. You're not my father. And when I am at home, I do leave the door open, if you had to know that for some odd reason. Um, I expected you could have came to me and be like, you know, when we're, you know, when we're in the studio, we want to keep the door closed because, you know, people be coming in and out loud and all that stuff. But no, you decided you wanted to talk to me any way you were going to. And I'm going to let you know now that that was a mistake. You're on my bad list now. And if you ever speak to me that way again, we're going to have problems, okay? That situation's done. Um, I wanted to talk about something that people wrote in and wanted to talk about. Wanted me to talk about. Um, one of my Twitter followers told me that they wanted to get my opinion on what do I think about girls being mad um, when their man is, you know, on the DL. And, you know, my whole my whole situation with the whole DL stuff is I don't agree with it. If you're gay, you need to just be gay. I don't condone being with a girl and a man at the same time. And, you know, not telling the girl that you're with a man and not telling the man that you're with a girl. Just, you know, playing everybody. I don't, I don't agree with it. But what I will say is, girls, when your man leaves you to be with another man, and you're sitting around the union and other places like that, you know, staring at them and, you know, whispering to your friends, you know, giggling and laughing. That makes you look dumb. Not the gay person. Because he took your man. That's a bad bitch. That's a bad bitch. So, I'm going to say cease and desist. Making yourself look dumb, especially when everybody knows that your man left you for a man. You know, it makes you really dumb to be gawking and laughing and giggling and whispering to your friends. That just makes you look dumb. So, on one side of the spectrum, I do not condone this whole DL stuff. It's stupid. If you're gay, be gay. Be you. Just be happy. 
And also, I don't condone women thinking that giggling and laughing is making that person look dumb. Especially since you don't know the whole situation and everything that happened. You just know what he told you. It makes you look really dumb. So, I'm going to give that advice. That's signing off with, you know, Dr. Darrell, um, bitchy. Um, and yeah. Now, we're going to get to the fun part and we're going to get to the 2010 first annual Greek Awards, okay? <laughs> we're going to give out a couple awards. Actually, there's only going to be two awards, but I'm going to, you know, give my opinion on everybody, okay? We'll see you at the awards. Deuce.